The Battle of Eniwetok was a battle of the Pacific Campaign of World War II, fought between 17 February 1944 and 23 February 1944, on Eniwetok Atoll in the Marshall Islands. Background The invasion of Eniwetok followed the American success in the Battle of Kwajalein to the southeast. Capture of Eniwetok would provide an airfield and harbour to support attacks on the Mariana Islands to the northwest. In 1943 the Japanese established light defences at Eniwetok. They believed that the Americans would strike at the southwestern marshals first. The 1st Amphibious Brigade reinforced the defenders in January 1944. Its commander, Major General Yoshimi Nishida along with a tank company, led by 1st Lieutenant Ichikawa, the 1st Amphibious began to construct defenses but repeated air attacks made this difficult and the tiny coral islands meant that defense in depth would be impossible. Vice Admiral Raymond Spruance preceded the invasion with Operation Hailstone, a carrier strike against the Japanese base at Truk in the Caroline Islands. This raid destroyed 39 warships and more than 200 planes. Battle. Naval bombardment of Eniwetok began on 17 February, and the 22nd Marine Regiment, commanded by Colonel John T. Walker, landed on Engerby Island on 18 February at 8.43 the next day. Resistance was light, and the island was declared secure by 14.50, though mopping up continued through the next day. U.S. losses included 85 dead and missing plus 160. 66 wounded. Intelligence suggested that the defences on Eniwetok Island would be heavier than planned, though there was a comparatively heavy preparatory bombardment before the 1st and 3rd battalions of the 106th Infantry Regiment went ashore at 0916 on 19 February, followed by the 322nds at 1425. However, the Japanese soldiers had strong spider hole positions, plus the Japanese concentrated their forces to the southwest, counterattacking the American flank, which forced the Americans to attack through the night. The island was not secured until 21 February. 37 Americans were killed or missing and 94 wounded. The mistake was not repeated at Parry Island. The battleships US Tennessee and US Pennsylvania and other ships delivered more than 900 tons of explosive onto the island. The 104th Field Artillery on Eniwetok and the 2nd Separate Pack Howitzer Battalions on Japton provided additional fire support. The 122nd and 222nd Marines landed at 0900 on the 22nd of February. At 19.30, the regimental commander radioed, I present you with the island of Pari, though operations continued through the next day. U.S. casualties included 73 dead and missing plus 261 wounded. The majority of Japanese soldiers were killed, though 105 survivors were captured. Aftermath Eniwito Catol provided a forward base for the United States Navy for its later operations.